Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing something a bit different and I'm going to be talking about my new MacBook Pro. So let's get to it and see why this MacBook is a game changer for music producers and entrepreneurs alike. This MacBook has been my go-to for the past two weeks and not just for making music but for video editing, working on Black Lotus and everything you can imagine that you can do in a computer has been done using the M3 MacBook Pro. This MacBook is powered by the latest M3 processors by Apple. That means it has the power to do anything professionals need, whether it be video editing, music production, running some really complex coding. It's a real powerhouse design for professionals that need the performance without any compromises whatsoever. I've been using Ableton Live 12 on this Mac for the past two weeks and I haven't had a single problem when loading up my projects, when doing some really awesome sound design sessions and it really handles the workflow super well. It's super fast, it's super responsive and it's really intuitive to use. I can go really crazy with the tracks. I can add a whole bunch of tracks with a whole bunch of effects and the MacBook Pro handles it like a champs. And that's really important because it makes it so much faster and so much easier to create new presets, new samples, because performance doesn't become an issue anymore. Going into video editing, I've tested this machine with both DaVinci Resolve and Premiere Pro. And let me tell you, I've been editing some really intense 4K footage for my YouTube videos and it's handled it so well and it renders even faster than what you can imagine. So I can do some really complex and really advanced video editing things. I can add overlays, I can add effects, I can add presets. And the MacBook Pro just displays this beautiful video in the timeline that then when it renders, it renders out so quickly. So I can upload even faster the YouTube videos that I make. I just need to transfer my data from my camera into my computer. I just edit it super quick on the go anywhere so I don't have to be in the studio, I don't have to be in the desk. I can be anywhere in the world editing my videos and I can do it super fast and super easy using the power of the M3 Pro. And it's not just about music production or video editing. This MacBook Pro has been the brains and the, and the tools to run and manage Black Lotus Audio because I'm doing all of the website coding, I'm doing all of the customer support, the email marketing, everything that I can possibly do to manage my business, I'm doing it here with the MacBook Pro and it makes it so easy to multitask. I'm having the power and integration of the Apple ecosystem where I can just copy and paste, I can use hands off and I can continue what I'm doing on my phone in the MacBook Pro makes it so easy for productivity. So I really can make things faster using this MacBook Pro combined with the Apple's ecosystem, which is one of the biggest reasons that I wanted to upgrade my old MacBook to this new MacBook Pro. So if you're a music producer, a video editor, do you use Photoshop? Do you use any software in general that is for professionals? It could be even Excel, web development. This MacBook Pro is definitely a must have for any professional that's working to speed up their workflow and do things faster and easier without being throttled or without being bottlenecked by their computer. It's a powerful machine that can keep up with your lifestyle and it makes it so easy to get everything done fast without worrying that it's gonna cause any problems. I don't have to worry that it's gonna crash. I don't have to worry that it's gonna be slow. I don't have to worry about long render time so that it's gonna crash because I loaded way too many FX in my music production. It does everything the way I want it to. And it's one of the biggest reasons that I chose this M3 MacBook Pro. So I'd love to hear any thoughts you might have or answer any questions. So as always, just leave a comment and I'm gonna be replying to each and every one of you. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. As always, don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and subscribe if you haven't already. I'm gonna be making some really awesome content with this MacBook Pro. I'm gonna be talking about FL Studio. I'm gonna be going really in depth. So stay tuned for that. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. This was Soundkiller and I'll see you in the next one.